Hi, this is Jason from Horrific Nightmares, and welcome back to Ranked. Now, this is the segment where Joe and I pick a franchise, watch the movies, and do a ranking. Very simple. Today, we're going to be talking about the Child's Play franchise. Now, there are eight movies in the Child's Play, Play franchise, and just try to keep in mind that this is just my opinion and the way I see the films. Now, coming in at number eight is Cult of Chucky. Uh, this one always felt a little off to me, and I'll explain why. After I watched two seasons of the series and kind of gave up on it because I didn't like it, and Joe and I watched this for um, Franchise Frenzy, I realized why it fell off to me, is that um, Don Mancini was gearing up for his series, and so many things were different in this, and it's not like I don't want the series to progress, it's just some things just felt off, like all these other Chuckies, and I know it was explained in Cult of Chucky, I just didn't like it. Yeah, I, I got through the first season of Cult of, or... I got through the first season of Chucky, and it was okay, but then the second season just went completely off the rails for me, and I just didn't like it, and I stopped watching it, which is very odd for me, because generally when I start a series, I normally finish it, normally. So, anyway, that is Cult of Chucky in eighth place. I love the lenticular cover, though. <laughs> All right. Coming up at number seven is Seed of Chucky. Now, we just did a positive spin for this, and there are things I like about this film. But I do feel like with this one and the one that I'm going to be talking about next, this is where Child's Play kind of, in my opinion, started to uh, change. And for me, not for the better. So, yeah. Check out my positive spin if you want to hear some good things about it, but all in all, it's just not one of my favorite Child's Play movies. All right, coming up at number six is Bride of Chucky. Now, like I just said, this is where, to me, the series starts going off the rails. I don't mind Tiffany. I know a lot of people don't like Tiffany, but I, I don't mind her. It's just... It, it just... To, for me, it got too convoluted. For me, it was about Chucky. Not that they couldn't bring another person in or another character in. But, I don't know. It just it just didn't feel like Child's Play to me. So, yeah. And that is Bride of Chucky. Alright, coming up next is the Child's Play remake. Now... I love this movie. I saw it in the theaters with my wife first day it came out, and I just had a blast with it. And I've liked it ever since. I think it was a really good reimagining, and to me, felt like child's play, actually. Even though I'm sure a lot of people don't think it does, but it does to me. Okay, coming up next is... Child's Play 2. Now, this was a tough one. Between this one and the next one, they could have flip-flopped on this. But this one is where it is because it's grown on me more over the years. This probably would have been further down the list originally with my other ranking years ago. But I do love Child's Play 2. I think it's a great film. And I like the introduction of Kyle. So, yeah. <clears throat> And it's Child's Play 2. Alright, coming up next is the original Child's Play. I still think this is a great movie. Um, a lot of people put the second one over this one, and I get why. But I saw this in the movie theater, so there's a ton of nostalgia with this. And there's still a lot of rewatchability with this movie for me. So... The original Child's Play. 
Such a great film. All right. At number two is Curse of Chucky. I, I just remember when they were talking about this coming out and everybody had a fit because of the way Chucky looked. Um, and there, of course, there was a reason why Chucky looked the way he did. And, of course, if you've seen the movie, you understand. But, and this was a really good return to form for Child's Play. In the midst of all the seed of Chucky and everything else, this was a really good return to form. And I still like this movie a lot. And my number one is Child's Play 3. I love this movie. I think it is so mean-spirited. I love the setting at the military academy. I think the characters are great. I think Andy is good when he's older. It's just got so much that I enjoy. So many classic parts in this film. The guy who's cutting the hair and everything. It's just... A movie that I look forward to watching. And the end is probably what puts it over the top for me. The fact that the end, they end up in a, um amusement park. So, Child's Play 3 has always been, you know, one of my favorites. But, in re-watching a lot of these films, it is my favorite. There is no doubt in my mind. So, Child's Play 3 is my number one. What do you guys think? Definitely thank you for watching, thank you for your comments, and remember guys, physical media matters. And don't forget to check out Joe's ranking for Child's Play. Peace.